or 19th June this year, the Union again took a bold step and met the Chief of Sauveld, where we deliberated on the issue of the Governor's visit at Siwa facility. He indeed acknowledged that the Governor was drunk, and he told us to take the matter slow. We did not blow it out of proportion. We accepted that as gentlemen. But why again today go ahead and give our, our health workers uh, show cause letters? It is quite unfortunate. We cannot be there to be sacrificed as sacri sacrificial lambs that tell the workers are there to be victimized simply because you want to defend the governor who actually was on a, a, a drinking spree during that particular moment. We want to tell him yes, we've said, and we have no apologies to make on that, and that as health workers representatives, we shall defend our members to the last person. The only thing we are demanding from the county government now is that those show cause letters should be withdrawn forthwith, failure to which, irrespective of the upcoming strike, the national strike, we shall be mobilizing our members to town tools in Wasingishu until our members are free from any victimization. Apart from the three official, three health workers I've told you, we have a medical superintendent who was not on duty during that day. He has again been served with a show cause letter. Then you ask yourself why? This person was not to be on duty. He was not on duty. The governor rushed there alone. And while there he invited the chief of Sauveld who went there and started seeing patients or reviewing patients until the time the governor left that place. So why should you victimize again the medical superintendent of health?